Hey everyone, welcome to Hogwarts Legacy stream. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, I do hope that you're gonna enjoy this stream because it's gonna be um, a short one, shorter than usual. So uh, that's why I wanna start right away. We have a lot to do. Um, I haven't streamed yesterday, that's why I wanted to stream today, but I have to go earlier today as well at night, so um, in the evening, I mean, <laughs> almost at night, uh, you can say it like that. Um, yeah, don't forget to press like if you enjoyed the stream and subscribe if you still haven't, and uh, let's switch to the game. We're gonna start right where we left off last time. There you go. I think everything is fine. I see the audio is in the mixer showing fine, so we should be good. Let me know if there is any issue. Um, it can happen. <laughs> OBS sometimes does some strange things. Okay, we need to go that way. I still love this game. My wife also have been playing it and uh, she's a big fan of Harry Potter, so... Uh, she loves it. She just spends all the time just running around the, uh, the castle and uh, learning some spells. <laughs> I basically do the same. Okay, we need to talk to Professor Fig right now. We'll have to probably sleep on the floor again. Maybe not. Quest started. Wait. That was interesting. You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. One sec. Um, I forgot to enable the uh, subtitles. I disable them just to make a screenshot. There we go. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Who's this? Sir, Professor Sharp. I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. What this book's about? Oh. oh dear. Some of these pages seem of to be course. missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them about Mr. Osric's death? I don't know how much I dare say. George tried to convince the ministry about Ranrock, but to no avail. My instinct is to follow the path we are on for the moment and keep the details to ourselves until we know more. I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. 
but you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. I don't think I do neglect them. <laughs> okay. So I think we can... Um, I know, not challenge. We can claim the reward. What is that? This one. No, not this one. This one. A yeah, legendary cape. We can also claim that one. Okay, let's check it out. Um, let's go to gear. Was it this one? Oh. <laughs> A cape stitched with mysterious designs earned by completing main quests. I don't know, I like... I like this one. I like the robe. And what about the uh, scarf? Dark art scarf. Hmm. I'm gonna keep the one that I have already. I need to go to Hogsmeade. I need to sell some uh, some of the items that we have. Because I had to destroy them. So I lost all coins that I could have traded for them. So let's... Um, let's go here. Sometimes it seems all right. As possible. Oh. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. A read mail. It's time to prove your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of Cross Ones. Also, the training dummy is still available. I should probably do that. Professor Fig and Weasley More... have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom. Okay. I to just sent you all post requesting to meet her in Lower Hawksfield. Okay. Is it here? Or is it on the world map? This is the world map. Most of the map is covered by fog, limiting what you can see. Hamlets are small communities throughout the world. This is a uh, hamlet, Lower Hawksfield. It's uh, a different village. Hamlets provide new opportunities for vendors, full flames, side quests and collectibles. As you explore, you will remove fog and reveal more of the map, unveiling new opportunities like hamlets, dungeons, bandit camps, and many other locations. I can't wait to do that. <laughs> well, for now, let's sell some items. Oh, there's a chest. 59 gold, let's go. Um, Where are the shops? Which ones do we go in? Revelio. Once uh, Olivander's wen shop. Once in variety uh, and all manners of flexibility. The best wand makers in Britain, if not the world. We know that not the whole world is using uh, the wands. So. Okay, so where we are? We are here. We can sell something at the Olive Wonders, right?
Hmm. I cannot talk to him. I thought we could. Interesting. Let's go to uh, the potions then. I also should be careful walking in here because in the last video I actually got the. Uh, well, do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. What can I do for you today? Um, how's it called? Copyright claim, yeah. For just the 30 seconds. Um, okay, I wanted to sell something. I wonder if it's... Um, will it cost me the same everywhere else if I sell them? Okay, let's sell this. We don't need that. Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. I don't really care about that. These are the ones that we have and equipped. They need to uh, implement the storage so I can keep some of this stuff in there. This is a zero defense, we don't need that. Traditional school rob. There we go. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. How many coins do we have right now? Will it show it here? 1360. Do we still have an access? Oh, to different types of, oh yeah, we still have an access to them. So if we, even if we sell them, we still have an access, that's great. Okay, oh, we can learn Expelliarmus, that's what we need to do. Successfully uh, avoid enemy attacks by dodge rolling. 0 out of 10. Cast Incendio on enemies. 0. 5. Where do we complete it? Do we need to go to the dueling ones? Is the knee Meet, here I come. Revelio. Let's check this out. Hogsmeade. The only all wizarding village in Britain. Hogsmeade has been a favorite haunt of Hogwarts students. 30 years and up for centuries. I don't know how I missed it last time. I really love this point of view. Everywhere. Uh, let's fast travel to somewhere. <laughs> oh, we have to go to Hogwarts map. Okay. Also need to attend the Herbology class. Crossed once, round three. We need to do that because I need to practice fighting. 
Even though if I even if I lose, it doesn't matter. Let's uh, let's practice Hello, first. Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Yeah, let's do this. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. Nicely done. Okay. That was easy. What else? Accio. Incendio. Good okay, one. so we pull the enemy to us and then uh do the incendio. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. No. Roll one. Oops. You'll get it. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. Oh, it's not ready yet. Why is it not ready yet? Incendio. Levioso. Accio. Incendio. Let's go. That's it. Impressive wand work. I take to face you in a duel. Nah. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. <laughs> Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in crossed ones. Other duelists had better beware. Okay, spell combination practice 2 is complete. I didn't know that there was this assignment. Okay, cast incendio and enemies 5 out of 5. Now we need to avoid them 10 times. Hmm. Let's try Hello, to uh, do a duel. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a no shot of glory? <laughs> Absolutely. I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Let's uh, let's try Sebastian this yes, time. Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get started. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Four of them. Are you serious? Uh, break through red shields with damage spells like the fire making spell incendio target lock lets you track enemies without aiming use R to change targets while locked Okay, I see We, we, we need to dodge, so that's what I'm trying to do right now. Wait, I need to I need to heal. <laughs> 
I jumped. I jumped instead of uh, dodging. Oh, they made a crap breakfast out of you that round. Good to try again. For sure. Yes, I'm ready now. Very well. Good luck out there. Akio. It didn't work. Incendio. I still I still press jump instead of a dodge. He's dead. <laughs> He's not dead, but Akio. Incendio. Akio. No. Oh, wrong button. Just trying to dodge. Oh, oh, wow, okay. Nice combo. Incendio. Alright, we won. <laughs> I could never duel like that. Did we get enough dodges though? What a victory! You've won the tournament! I got lucky. It was mostly luck, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> Please, you wouldn't have got this far on luck alone. Now, to the victor goes the prize! And so it is my great honor to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment! Thank you. It's been What's an honor. Accomplishment? You earned Wait. it! You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. I don't even have them. What kind of reward did we get? Yes. Quest updated. I think we got it. We can learn Expelliarmus. Yeah. Can travel there. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Where are we though? I didn't see us. <laughs> I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. 
Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Let's go. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Yeah, we need to assign it. Uh, which one was it? This is Lumos. Um... Oh, this one. Okay, uh, hold to assign. I'm gonna assign it it's, uh, instead of Incendio. Expelliarmus. You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Disarms wounds. Leviosa. Expelliarmus. Still at it, I see. Oh, I see. Leviosa. Accio. I wonder if there will be a better way to switch between the um, the spells. Okay, we learned it. What are you up to now? So many people are here. Does no one have glasses? Everyone's just chilling. <laughs> I wish my study was like this. Okay, what's uh, our next quest? The girl from Herbology class. Should I attend Herbology class because we are pretty much in Hogwarts right now? I don't think I've been to this area before. Look at that. I'm going to have my own telescope one day. I've already decided that Jupiter's my favorite. <sighs> oh. <laughs> um, yeah. We can collect this. I've read 1,000 magical herbs and fungi at least a thousand times. Something so peaceful about tending plants is lovely. That is cool. I can appreciate it. <laughs> Greenhouses. I think. Oh. What we need to do is actually. How can we craft the healing potion? Um, pork lump juice. We need that. Oh my, we have only one health potion left, which is not perfect. Good 
morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora, dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, A little treat for your auntie. Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in Herbology is knowledge. The prudent Herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing ball. I hope it's gonna help now us. Then, <laughs> today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. No way. Akio. Is it the one that's screaming? Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Oh, they don't have headphones yet. <laughs> now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Hey, Kirin, how's it going? What did you discuss during the class? Quickly! Place your mandrake in the new pot and cut down the soil! Did you just discuss uh, Hogwarts Legacy? <laughs> or Mandrake Roots? I don't think so. Like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. I'm very uh, sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now, Clippy. for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. What is Clippy? Hmm. I wonder if he sent it on Discord. Okay, I'll check it out. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. I'll say. Nearly went deaf. Well, yes. Of course, the cry of a mature mandrake can be fatal. So remember to keep those ears protected. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Plant Dittany's seeds at the or roses. potting table. So you have discussed your clip. Dittany's <laughs> restorative properties make no it a way. vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Growth time 10 minutes, a small plant. The leaves of this mesic... Uh, oh, is it the one that we need actually for the health potion? You can add fertilizer to this plant to increase its yield. You can create fertilizer by conjuring and dung composter. I know I don't I don't know that well one. Well done. Once it can be harvested, your dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that Exciting. some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Here, dear, and let them have a good chomping. 
Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. That's not exciting, that's scary. Will we get actually a notification when this uh, plant grows? The edges grow? mustn't curl and turn brown like that. Now remember, a wand is not a trowel. And of course, Jeff, we will, we will grow one like specifically for you. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. Yeah, let's go. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well. That was too easy. Thank you. What do you mean? He are. wasn't good at Home all. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it. And they'll do the rest. Toss the cabbage. Hold L1 and tap R to open the tool wheel and assign the Chinese chomping ch cabbages. Then tap L1 to use their assigned tools. What? Okay. Attack target. Do I need to use L1? Look at that. They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that'd have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. Suppose they could come in handy, that's for sure. I suppose they could prove useful outside They're of the like greenhouse. They're like a, a Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Cabbage pickup. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. I don't want Take to. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Well, let's collect all of it. There we go. We got seven. Is there a limit on how many cabbages you can have? Can we make she from that cabbage? <laughs> I don't know if you, you know what she is. It's basically a soup from cabbage, but it's a Russian name. Oh, what is that? Get on your leaves. Um, inventory. So, how do we craft it? Is it in collections? We need to go in here. Oh, we still need this Horklump juice. What is? What even is that? Do we have to buy it? I mean, we're pretty rich. We can, we could do it. Reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves. I, shall I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Don't care much for plants, honestly. No, I care. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Oh, yeah? That sounds suspicious. <laughs> well, okay. 
hope those mandrakes are really relishing their new pot. Inspect. Cost me my Ready in five so minutes. To make anything grow, we must first understand it. What is in here? But we could go through this door. Why did he lead me? F what? That that doesn't make sense. That's where the cabbage was. On another adventure, are we? For sure. Oh, this one is locked. Yeah, the center hall leads to everywhere. My house broom will do me fine for a while, I'm sure. Are there any chests with the eyes? Because we know how to open them now. At the beginning of the game, I was uh, I was finding them left and right, and now I cannot find any. <laughs> but okay, let's see what we have next. Potion class again. Next class I must attend is potion. It's taught by Professor Sharp. Okay, I guess we're attending classes tonight. Back to school, I see. Wouldn't that be always or someone from the Ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade? Professor Black would never allow that. I saw an aura badge on Professor Sharp's desk. I thought he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Hotel. I was uh, very lucky. Come on, fly there. Yes. There we go. <laughs> A house token, let's go. Uh, I also saw that we got new glasses. And they look like they're better. Yeah, they give m better defense. But why this one is legendary? I don't... I don't see why this one could be better. There could be a trade. Oh, three. Wait. Three. Wait. I don't. There is level three trade slot. Okay. But we don't have any trades yet. So we'll uh, use the ones that uh, give us more defense. Oh, I thought it was uh, something. This room reminds me of Harry Potter um, Lego game. Uh, 
Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Yay. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. I need it now. How do I do this? Show me! Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Okay. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. What if we sneeze? <laughs> Do we, uh... Craft the potions like this all the time? That's fun. Or is it just uh, a learning process? I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Okay, we need to find his office. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors... Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single thwooper feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. And he won't notice, right? Yeah, I'm not sure it's a good idea. I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad side. That's you true. Thwooper feathers aren't that valuable. Sharp won't even miss it. Of course, yeah. I can't. I've enough to worry about collecting the ingredients he wants me to get. I'm afraid I can't help you. I understand. I'll sort something else out. Yeah. Boy. Your potion should not be Memorandum from Auror's office. Subject Borgin and Burks. Borgin and Burks has had increased amount of activity outside of ordinary shop hours, particularly in the, f in the wee hours. Of the night. What does it mean, we are? Let me know in the chat because I, I'm, I, I don't think I know. With suspicious deliveries being made to the shop's back entrance. I guess it's like um, bad night or something. Given what we know of the shop's reputation, we are adding more orders to join those that have already been watching the shop. You are amongst the new additions. Further instruction to follow. Okay.
Can we collect those? Blue flat cap. Which adds some defense, as I'm guessing. A fooper uh, feather. Can we get it for ourselves? stations organized and free of clutter should you chop the didney or crush it the wrong answer ocean station unlocked loss of your eyebrows okay a jurus potion let's uh, let's craft it brewing time 26 seconds oh that's pretty cool And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Oh yeah, he is good with Damn potions. It. Yeah, of course. Oh, the smell. Dragon <laughs> What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. I knew it. Okay, can we craft something else? No. Nice. I would want to get more uh, uh, healing potions. I brewed an Edoras potion as you asked, Professor. Glad you managed to stay on task. Not every class is so eventful. I saw Mr. Weasley speaking with you earlier. He can be quite persuasive. Glad you managed to resist. You've done well today. <laughs> I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. And you can keep that fwoppa feather. This time. <laughs> that will be all. <laughs> I took a... Yeah, for myself, though. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an Auror. I wish he talked about it more. How did he know? I'm sure he hasn't been to his uh, office yet. He's got cameras everywhere, I think. Cameras. That they don't have cameras yet. Class. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. Well, for certain, you'd have helped. I'm glad I avoided trouble. Sharp certainly seemed upset with you. His bark's worse than his bite. I think deep down he respects my artistic spirit. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise. Fewer explosions. Yeah. I don't believe you, boy. Okay, um... What's next? I don't feel like it gives us notification when the plant has grown. Ugh, oh, my robes are going to reek from Gareth's inspiration. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wiggermeld potion. Oh, thank you. That means a lot coming from a fellow Ravenclaw. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wiggermeld potion on their first try. Well done. I'm just too good. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some I students seem so everything. confounded by potion recipes, it's as if they're written in gobbledygook. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor there, really, but I am a self-taught speaker. Merlin's beard, good conversation is the enemy of free time. I must return my book, Gateway to the Far Stars, before my next class. Speaking of stars, we'll be in astronomy together. You'll love it. Professor Shaw is firm, but quite clever. See you soon, no doubt. See you soon. Okay. Um, we need to 
get that plant. How how do we go there? I don't even remember what it is. I think it's in a herbology. Oh, potions classroom, yeah. No, not potions, greenhouses. Let's travel there. I'm pretty sure it's ready already. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented blue powder. I think it's here. Yeah. Oh, it's restarting. Nice. Okay, can we install <laughs> more plants? It doesn't look like so. Also, we have some furniture that we could also um, set up, but I don't know how to do that and where. Okay, now we need to go to... To Natty. Okay, um, in Lower Hawksfield. Let's see the map. Oh my. Have to go around the castle. Yeah, let's explore a little bit. Maybe we'll find something that we have missed last time. So I remember I, uh, I have already been here. I find if I try to look at ten sipping potions, it seems to keep sharp off my back. It works quite well unless he asks you a question and then it's not. Ooh. Revelio. Flattened armor. What? <laughs> This set of armor belonged to Sir Skaggle Thorpe, the Headless, who unwisely challenged the mountain troll to a game of musical chairs. And uh, I guess the troll just smashed that poor guy. Well, rip. Try riding a hippogriff. You will soon learn that Shigawa is technically. We got this castle. Okay, I was looking for too long. I think we need to go this way. Hopefully they don't mind that we are walking on grass. What's here? Hmm. What are you up to now? Flying glass. All these details, I love them. I think these are mushrooms, yeah. I don't even know why we need them for... <laughs> but we have a lot of them. There's a cool view here. Out of the castle. Almost fell down. <laughs> Look at that. 
gonna hide my face. We have already seen this spot, um, but it was at night. This looks peaceful. Hello? Oh, we cannot interact with it, okay. <laughs> What's that? Groundskeeper's tools. One might surmise that this set of tools could be enchanted to create all sorts of furnishings for a cozy hat, as large as the occupant may need. What is it for? Have a headwear, I forgot about that. <laughs> Look at that hat. <laughs> We're gonna remove it. Fooper weather. The feathers are shed by brightly colored and beautiful foopers. The fooper weather can be used to upgrade and assign traits to gear. Oh. House token. We'll need to insert it later. Is there a cave or something? I should investigate. Oh boy. I'm afraid that we may die here. Let's hope not. Collections upgraded. Level 18. Or 11, sorry. Oh, okay. It's not attacking us at all. Is it stuck or something? Why is it not attacking? Challenge unlock defeat Dark box. One out of five, okay. What's in here? Oh, I should I I should probably not do that. Hork lump juice. Nice. Akio. Oh, I think we need to move it here. Do we need to use uh, incendiary here? Incendio. Oh yeah. I'm kind of scared. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. 
Uh, what we need to do is actually we need to craft more health potions. <laughs> because I'm pretty sure I will die there. I'm scared. All right, let's go. Let's go. We'll see what's inside. I'm scared. Okay. Doesn't look like there is anyone in here or anything. We need to sell more stuff again. Is that it? Akium Revelio. Huh. I think something is waiting for us when we uh, exit here. Nope. Interesting. What is this? Alright, let's go and meet with Natty. She's probably been waiting for us for too long. <laughs> Hopefully I can sell some stuff right there. I wish we had a room so we could fly. Hello. It is good to see you, my friend. Nice to see you, my young friend. Hey everyone is so friendly. <laughs> Level one lock. Um let's go and sell some stuff. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Uh, any rumors, rumors going about? Any whispers going about the town? You may have noticed we have a bit of a rivalry with Upper Hogsfield. Not much to it, but we're still the better of the two Hogsfields. <laughs> better than most other places, too. Who are you? Can you tell me a bit about yourself? Oh, let's see. Well, I am Lower Hogsfield's preeminent potioneer, and I was once a lowly Hogwarts student like you. In fact, I'll give you the Hogwarts discount. <laughs> it's the standard price. <laughs> My price is a low enough already. <laughs> nice, see. nice discount. Um, all right, let's see. What do you have for sale? We'll probably sell something what to him. What can I help you with today? Um, let's sell. Yeah, let's sell this. I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> and what else? This. I want to keep this one. This one's maybe. There we go. We are rich. 
Uh, what do we have here? Oh, we have a Wigan Well Potion. We can purchase. Let's purchase a couple. We are ah, rich, yes. so we can a do it. Wonderful choice. <laughs> Maxima Potions. Increases the drinker's spell damage for a limited amount of time. We'll need to learn that one. A Juris Potion. A potion that enhances the drinker's defense by covering them with a durable rocky skin. Nice. We have one, I think. How do we use it, by the way? I hope to see you again sometime. How do we use the potion? That's a good question. I'm sure we have one. Do you have to go in here and go to collections and use it there? From there? That is a really good question. How do we use another potion? This is ingredient, wand handles, revealio pages. A new challenge, combat challenge. What is that? Gear trade recipe reward. Nice. That's how you get the trades for the gear. I, I got it now. Um... Wait, we have a gear? Oh, war hand, uh, wand handle. <laughs> I like this one still. Oh, it's night already. I never thought Ramrod. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. Has Ranrock's lot ever attacked you like this before? They've been taunting and threatening me for a while now. But they've always believed that violence is the only way to get what they want. Things have taken a much darker turn of late. Ranrock is getting more powerful and his loyalists know it. They feel untouchable. Ramrock assumed that all goblins would agree to follow him, but he was wrong. Many of us would like a diplomatic end to the discord with wizard kind. That's good to hear. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your cards. That is very kind of you. I think it's I think a side mission. took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. Yeah, we'll, uh, we will help him at some hmm. point. Seems a pleasant enough little place. This is a very <sighs> little place. It is good to see you, my friend. Let's talk to her. Hello, Natty. How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmead. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood and Harlow after you? I'm all right at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time, but I am hoping now you might tell me why they were looking for you. Should we talk to her? Should we say it to her? I feel like... Whatever we are hiding right now from Professor Weasley and from everyone else, it may backfire. I don't know. I feel like I, I can't trust her. So let's uh, let's share. 
Hopefully I'm right about this one. They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A port key brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. Is that the magic you used fighting the trolls in Hogsmeade? I think so. I I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it, and I've cast magic I can't otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. And I will have more questions. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us, to all of us, which is why I wanted to speak to you. I realized something that day in Hogsmeade. You displayed such courage fighting that troll, and Serona wasn't intimidated one bit by Rookwood and Harlow. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. Let's go. Stand. Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And the fact that they're working with Ranrock, well... All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. I will. So what do you think, guys? How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? What do you think? Was it the right choice to tell her about our uh, adventure with Professor Fig? I don't have time to argue. I've told you repeatedly not to stray far from home, especially when I'm inside with your little sister. Wait, who's uh, who's arguing? Oh, that's enough. I'm too tired for your stories today. You stay right here where I can see you. Now, why don't you do some more drawings for me? Hmm? Wait, what? Who is she talking to? <laughs> I I don't see it. Okay. I heard uh, a child's voice. Help the stranger. Let's go and help the stranger. Uh, it's kind of dark right now. It's very scary. They must have come this way. Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood don't give a doxy's nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. No. Students, you can't be... <laughs> no way, we're gonna be Leave fighting them. Alone. Let's go. Wrong way. Show off all you want. Accio. Incendio. Easy. More. Oh, watch the light go out of your eyes. The collection section of your field guide has been updated with a new enemy type. You may learn valuable insights on enemies such as their weaknesses to certain spells. Ooh, that is scary. 
bank. You'll take this. You're the dog of my dead body. You're a bit dodgy with your skills, aren't you, sweetheart? No, oh, that was too far away. What on earth just Let's happened? Go. I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. That's true. Are you all right? I am, thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two them. Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin, gave me a book when we were students at Hogwarts. Typical hard-working Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a travelling vendor, hears what's going on in the Highlands before I do. I'm pretty sure I heard this name. Maybe um, in the revealing pages somewhere? You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Yeah, I, I thought, thought that Merlin. Merlin and the tales about King Arthur's court were a myth. Mere myth? <laughs> You're lucky Sir Cadogan didn't hear you. Chatters <laughs> are endlessly about his connection to Merlin from his portrait at Hogwarts. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. For well, sure. Then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet. Mm -hmm. Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the centre. That started me thinking, what if... The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the centre of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honours? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. Let's do this. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. This Can we trunk. get some? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Sweet on the swell. And we'll see what happens. Something's gonna happen. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these pyres. Do we need to light them up? Incendio! Balin's beard! Hey, hey, I knew it. The pyre sink. Wait. Curious. The pyres are back where they started. Do we need to do it quickly? Incendio. Come on. 
I got stuck in there. Let's go. Today, I can hardly believe it. That was uh, really cool. This challenge just remind me of opening the Nornir chests. <laughs> you can go to war, Ragnarok. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. The pleasure and is do mine. Be out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Quest complete trials of Merlin. Let's go. Different challenges offer different rewards. Complete Merlin trial challenges to increase your gear. I I have I have no, I didn't see gear something. <laughs> Haven't seen what Greetings. it said exactly. I understand you're quite the enterprising young Ravenclaw. Professor Fig tells me you found a long lost book for him. I'd like to talk to you about it. Okay. I can teach you for some assistance. Sure. Hello. Can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes. My name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake doesn't sound too appealing. Underwater... Underwater advent... We can swim? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid! Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Me? You're not gonna go with me? Should I know who your family are? You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. The Pinch Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't yet know the name certainly one day will. Okay, I'll have to think about this. Mm. <laughs> It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Dive in the Black Lake and find the astrolabe. 
Um, okay, uh, let's uh, let's try and do that. What is this? Why is it here? Uh, let's see how far. Wait, it doesn't show the marker here. That is interesting. Rewards, appearance reward. I don't know why it's not shown... Wait, what is this? A leech loose. Oh, juice. Loose. <laughs> okay, well, let's uh, see. I actually didn't know that you can swim in this game. That's kind of cool. Plus uh, L3 to swim faster. Okay. This must be where the pink Smedley family astrolabe is. Knitted jumper attire. Okay. So we cannot go underwater. Grey Adventure Ensemble. Wait a second. I don't know why I always press on the map. Uh, gear. Defense 71, and this one is locked. Cool. We are upgrading our defense. Peach Smedley family astrolabe, Wigan Weld Potion. I should let Grace Take know that. that I found her family astrolabe. High Society Fedora. Rack Dewing Gloves. They're also legendary. Alright, let's go back. Can we fight during our swimming session? <laughs> We're all wet. It better be worth it. I trust you didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? <laughs> I did, and it's yours for a price. I did, and I'm keeping it. All right, let's. Uh, I let's, did. Let's give it to her. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me, and for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Thank you again, and I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. Collection updated mermaid mask. Let's go. Um, let's see here, got the headwear, which is uh, not good, and the headwear, handwear, go. Yeah, let's keep these gloves on, they're kind of cool. 
challenges. Exploration. One of two. Okay. Combat. Defeat ten dark wizards. Okay, enemies. Um, it said that we can find what they, what kind of spells we can use on them. Okay, among the quicker of Rockwood agents, these witches will surprise their opponents with back-to-back -back attacks. Their powerful reductor curse can be blocked by shield charms, by but interrupting that cast with the severing charm will spin them to the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Severing Charm. We don't have that one. Uh, well, uh, they're vulnerable to all sorts, or all sorts of attacks, okay? Revelio can help you find them when exploring their habitats. They can blend with the environment. That's, uh, yeah, that's scary. While recovering from their attack launch, they are vulnerable to four spells that will flip or force their bodies in various di directions. When its mouth is wide open, the also can be used on its fleshly tongue to hoist it into the air. Cool. The distance will not protect against an angry troll, as it will tear up chunks of earth and throw them at its targets. After the troll slams its club on the ground with both hands, flipping it upward with flipando will have greater leverage than usual, sending the club into the troll's face for a powerful blow. Hitting a troll with its own boulder will catch it off a guard and make it more vulnerable to follow-up attacks. We have so many spells to discover yet. But uh, I hope you are enjoying the stream. Thank you all so much for watching. I do appreciate you a lot. Also, if you uh, could press a like if you enjoy the stream, that would help even more. Because YouTube likes likes. And uh, if you are not subbed yet, uh, consider to sub because we will play this game Mostly every day, of course, if I'm not busy, I will play this game for sure. Okay, what do we do next? And of course, thank you all. Um, next quest, Carted Away, suggested level 2. How far is it? 643 steps. Go to the goblin camp? I wish we had a... A broom right now. Is it broom? Am I saying it right? Should go through the forest, why not? Oh, we wanted to sell stuff. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Yeah, let's sell them. We don't want to keep too many because we have a limit on the amount of uh, items we can have. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? It's better to sell them, I guess. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Uh, what do we want to sell? I guess this. I don't need hats, to be honest. I hope to see you again sometime. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Hey, that is... Scary, what is this? Oh, that's a crystal. More crystal. Some sheep in here. Huh. B. 
Beasts welcome. Revelio. Habridian Black Scale. The Habridian Black is a large dragon that can grow to over 9 meters in length. A large rough scale originally belonging to one of these beasts is one of the prized possessions that Archie Bickle keeps in his hideout. Collect field guide pages in the highlands. And this is a hideout for that fourth Archie, yeah. I guess we haven't unlocked him yet. What is that? Oh, is that Merlin challenge? I know a Merlin trial when I see one. Okay, uh, what do we do here? Do we pull it? No. Oh, there's another one. Are there more? Oh. Akio. This looks intriguing. Okay, I see another one here. Dark Mongrel. What is that? Another one. That's scary. Challenge unlocked. Complete dueling fist. Feats. Mongrel Fur. I didn't even see what they look like. Uh, look like wolves, something. Okay, we still need to complete this trial. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Probably. I'm just trying to practice more. The spells. Okay. Oh. Akio. Not so tricky after all, Merlin. Let's go. Completed another one. Challenge is complete. And what does it give? We can claim something maybe in the challenge. Be exploration. Oh yeah. Complete inventory expansion reward. Oh, that is that is great. How many items can we have now? Okay, let's see. 14 out of 24. Isn't it the same? I'm pretty sure it's the same. Maybe it was 20 though.
New inventory slots unlocked. Four. Yeah, so we had 20. Now we have 24. Let's go. Okay, we need to go to that gom goblins camp. Oh, why? Incendio. Protego. Stupid. Defeat spiders. I'm on the right track. Are you serious? <laughs> why did I go here? I already regret it. Okay, here we go. That's the goblins camp. Should probably do this. An encampment. This must be it. Well, I wouldn't give for a cup of mushroom tea. There are four of them Looks here. As if there's more than one way to enter. Okay, so what do we need to do? Hit the ranger with stupefy. Keep two enemies airborne five seconds. That was the main entrance. Free the cards from the encampment. I see, I see. Should we just start the fight? <laughs> Is he still looking this way? Is it possible to go from come from behind and do something? No, it doesn't look like so. Right. You've been paying attention in defense against the dark arts, I see. You don't believe you can defeat me, do you? Leviosa! Ah! 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 Oh. How many of you are there? What? There are more. Where are they? Oh, Enjoy suffering, but this is sad. Leviosa. It, it is. Incendio. Leviosa. Coming out at once. How childish. Run, run, what is it? Oh my, there are so many here. Show that there was something attacking me. Red Rock will lead us to victory. Always on the defensive. How do I hit him with stupefy if 
I cannot protect against his attacks. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. There is another one here. Oh, I needed to keep two enemies airborne. Oh, uh, where's another one? Oh. Well, that was quite something. Now to free Arn's carts. Let's go. Should have done better, but uh, this will do. At least we didn't die. <laughs> Rebellion. What is that? There's the box here. Where where are the cards? Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, they're here. Yeah, they're gonna move by themselves. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Light Herpologist hat. Okay, so let's see what we have gotten. We got some gear here. Defense 85. And now we got a robe here, which has a better defense, by the way. But we are gonna switch to this one. Okay. Challenges. Let's see. We got combat unlocked. Defeat 30 goblins. I see. The combat is actually the most fun on this game. Cannot wait to learn more spells. Revelio. What does it do? Akio. Why there a light up? Incendio. Hmm. I knew it. I think we need we'll need this box for something. Akio. Maybe to put it here. Nice. Another chest.
There could be something over there. I'm not sure. Okay, let's do this uh, Merlin challenge. What do we do with them? Levioso. Incendio. Levioso. Accio. Is that what it did, right? It uh, light up the lamps. I'm not sure what do I need to do with them. Okay, the basic spell doesn't work. What else do we have? Expelliarmus. Uh, could that work? <laughs> Expelliarmus. Nope. Hmm. I guess we'll have to come back here. <laughs> it's already day. <laughs> Pretty sure no one missed us. What's over there? Wait, what? No. And this. Oh, there is more. Oh, what did I do? No! was close <laughs> okay at least I'm getting better at protection spell we have s we've gotten so much fur now I don't even know what to do with it what does this sign mean I don't see anything else in here. Except for those uh, moonstones. Is that a spider? There's a victory that came none too soon. Ugh. <laughs> this guy's like, hello. <laughs> what are you doing here in the forest? <laughs> yeah, 
hasn't been noticed. Yeah, we have completed that uh, trial, but I don't know about the other one. I don't know what to do with that one. I tried everything in Cindio and uh, every spell and uh, it didn't work. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? I just what want to sell something. Sale? What can I help you with today? Um, we don't need the hat. This one is two hundred gold. Twenty-six oh, defense again, for those sometime. glasses. Let's check it out. Gear and face wear. Now let's hide them. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with? We don't care about what you have for sale, honestly. Uh, let's sell this. Okay, there we go. I have 2,000 gold. Rich. On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. That was no trouble. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. That sounds what a nice idea. Aren't great, I? yeah. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. You're welcome. All the best to you. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my wares. There's a chest here somewhere. Oh. Cool. <laughs> There's another chest, Not but sure it, I, I think it's inside. In place like this. I think it's inside here. Yeah, we can't pick that lock yet. Unless it's uh, on top of this building. <laughs> True. All right, uh, let's go to map. Hogwarts. Now oh, let's actually see the quests. We need to go to our wonders. I see. Let's uh, let's go to Hogsmeade. I love that village. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Probably not. 
historically speaking, there's never been a team like this. Alice in game. They've done a great job. Good of you to come. My friend, Professor Fig, speaks highly of you and your resourcefulness. He was vague as to details, but mentioned your having tracked down a difficult to find book. I wondered if you'd be willing to do a little detective work on my behalf. I'm sure uh, I'm not sure how will this benefit me. <laughs> Sounds of intriguing. course, Mr. Ollivander. Sounds most up my street. Wonderful. You see, about a century ago, an heirloom applewood wand with a fairy wing core went missing from this very shop. My great aunt suspected a student named Richard Jackdaw. He'd been serving as an assistant here and suddenly vanished. Richard Jackdaw? Like the bird. In fact, he was known to frequent the Hogwarts Owlry. We searched there, of course, but found no wand. We did find a series of statues similar to Jackdaws. I'm certain they're a clue, but I cannot figure out where they lead. Jackdaw was last heard tittering about some pages with a map he'd stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. Why don't you continue searching the Olery? Why that wand? Why did he steal it? Is there anything special about the wand? Oh, yes. It's terribly special, but not in the way you might think. It won't grant special powers to the caster, no. Nothing like that. But it will ease the hearts and minds of the Ollivanders to know of its return. And that power is immeasurable. Why did he steal it? Why would the thief have taken the wand? I must admit I have no idea. From what I can gather, he fancied himself an adventurer of sorts. Always looking for trouble. In fact, after he went missing, rumor had it his ghost was seen in Hogsmeade. Never heard much about him after that, but it seems as if his adventurous spirit may have got the better of him. Perhaps he thought that the wand had some special power simply because of its esteemed lineage. Astonishing how misunderstood the art of wand making is. I'll have a look for you. You certainly give me plenty to go on. Ah, oh, you've brought hope to this old wandmaker's heart. Professor Fig was right. You are a remarkable student. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. Investigate the Olary. 876 steps. Well, well, we are not gonna walk there. Um... I still don't remember where the shops are. Thompson Scrolls, the potions. Let's go here. Ah, it's always nice to see a familiar face. Uh. Beast Feeder Spellcraft. Beast Toy Box Spellcraft unlocks the ability to conjure a beast toy box. Use the toy box to pick to pick out your beast's favorite toys for them to play with. Chopping Station unlocks the ability to conjure a chopping station. The station periodically produces a plant byproduct, so keep an eye on it. Um where do we install all of these stations? I don't I don't know. They haven't, um... They haven't taught us yet. Anything else I can do to help. Oh, I saw there was a page flying there, yeah. Akio. There we go. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Sometimes. Uh, let's go to map. And we'll need to go back to Hogwarts, I guess? Or is it past Hogwarts? A world map. Oh yeah, it's a past Hogwarts. Oh, I know that place. 
I don't think there is... Um, I don't think there is... A fast travel point there. Okay, I think this is the closest waypoint we can get to. Oh, it shows we need to go back. Wait, did I miscalculated it? <laughs> oh, we need. To, oh, we need to go there. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, it's fine. I think we can just walk from here. Festral collection updated. Oh, that's how they are called. So it seems like we cannot interact with it. The travel would be so much faster on the broom. Cannot wait to get it. I'm sure it's gonna happen soon enough. We just need to progress in the main story. There's a great view of uh, the Ho of Hogwarts here. I really love how they've done with the weather as well. Looks very um, close to real life. I don't want to fall down from here, so I need to be careful. It's so cool that we can actually go inside of this building. On the side of Hogwarts. Still so many things to explore, so many places. The statues Mr. Ollivander mentioned must be upstairs amongst the owls. That's a long way up. <laughs> Don't mind me, Owls. I'm just here to help a friend. Now, where are those statues? Akio! I... Oh, here's a welcome surprise. <laughs> Nothing. Jack Doll statue. Wait, interact. Empty perches. Could be the right size for jackdaws. Or statues of jackdaws. No statues here. Akio! Oh, we need to place them there? I'd best keep looking. I see. <laughs> the souls just looking at us like, what are you doing here? Revelio. Hogwarts Owls. School owls and owls owned by students can be found in the Hogwarts Owlery. Owlery. <laughs> One is advised to explore carefully, keeping an eye out for owl droppings and regurgitated mouse skeletons. I'm sure they're nice. The owls. Oh, there's another one. Akio. Wait, did I pick it up already? Ah, 
I hope it didn't fall down. I don't see the interaction. This will do nicely. Hmm. Oh, there are more upstairs. Birds aren't afraid of height. Perhaps I should look a bit higher. Accio. I'll take that, thank you. Nothing. It's also moving nice forward a little bit. I'd best keep looking. Here's a welcome surprise. <laughs> There's so many items already. Fell down. <laughs> This'll do nicely. There we go. My best keep looking. Okay. I saw one fell down there. Oh, the treasure map. The bridge. We need to light up the candles or something. Hmm. We need to remember hmm, that. A map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. <laughs> Nothing. Did we open all of this things here? Yeah, let's go down. Wait, what was that? Okay, we need one more. Isn't that that one that disappeared? I feel like it just fell down somehow. It's not here. I hope it didn't... Uh, I hope I didn't get a bug or something. Because there was this statue. But it just disappeared before I could take it. I don't think I will be able to complete it today, unfortunately, in this stream. I have to complete it next time. Yeah, I don't see any other... ...places where they could be. Unless if we somehow could go up there. Like fly up there <laughs> somehow. I don't know how. Because it seems like there is... There is a ghost there. Huh. Okay. Well, 
but I have to uh, end here with uh, this view here. Uh, thank you all so much for coming. I hope you enjoyed this stream. Uh, it was uh, a shorter stream than usual, but I still enjoyed it a lot. We had uh, a little bit more action in here, a little bit more fights, which I um, I happy to do, <laughs> and I like doing them. And we need more practice, of course, but we are getting better. I feel like. Again, if you enjoyed the stream, please don't forget to press like and subscribe if you are not subscribed yet. Because we will do more uh, Hogwarts Legacy playthrough on this channel. Uh, but uh, right now I will say goodbye to you and have a good night. Have a good rest of the day. Bye!